In history, things have been awful for disabled people. They were locked up in asylums, forced into care homes. But now society has improved and people see no matter how you are different, you deserve the same rights as everyone else. People are born with human rights and just because you are different in any way doesn't mean you should be excluded from this ever. For example, it can be hard for someone if they have a disabled child and they have no experience of disabled people. Often families don't know what will happen in the future for a disabled child, so it can be hard, but all people have rights and everyone should know them. Some parents are really fantastic and support their child and teach them their rights when they are young and make sure that they have access to opportunities. I am glad to say that this was my experience with my parents. They found out I have cerebral palsy when I was one years old and they did a lot of research and a lot of people think that those with cerebral palsy won't have long and full lives, but my parents ignored them and made sure they taught me about my rights, gave me opportunities, hopes and dreams about my future. And I am so thankful they did. Everybody has a right to a good education with the proper support. My parents fought hard for two years for this and helped me be in mainstream school where I could access the building, my education, friendships, a social life, and a future. It is important that all people, no matter who you are, have access to this because it's your human right. I need personal assistants who support me every day. It is part of my rights to be able to interview and employ the best people for me. I need my voice to be heard and to choose my own support. When I was eight, I started direct payments and having my own personal assistant. This helped me with my independence and not to need my parents so much since then I have had some brilliant women in my life who I employ. Many disabled people even now go into care homes because people don't know about their rights and they have no other option. This to me feels cruel and leaves disabled people very vulnerable. Last year, my local council wanted to cut my budget and said I could only have agency staff to come four times a day for 20 minutes a time. They said they would not provide support for me to go out to voluntary work meet friends or try new opportunities. 
Luckily, they have given me emergency money for 10 months and are 2k audit to make the cuts. Ha ha. At the moment, I have got lots of good people around me who believe in me. That is really important in the future. I want to live independently. It will take time, but that is okay. I would like to finish by wishing you all lots and lots of luck, aim high, and don't be afraid to follow your dreams, thank you.